Hello world, it is Saturday, um, September 20, 24th or something, and it's around 12.20. I'm waiting for my lunch, frozen pizza, to be made. And here I am, sitting on the stoop, drinking an espresso and reading this book. And I thought, what a good time to make a vlog entry. To recap, the purpose of these vlogs are to capture the moment, to capture the spirit of um, this human that you see here, and capture it on video for all of eternity and for all of the world to see and know. So this is an exercise in mindfulness in awareness, in meditation, and in, in contemplation over existence, and awareness of identity, of time, of um, causation, of information, of self, of awareness, of language, of um, how the individual fits in the collective, how the individual fits in the world, and how the individual fits in the rapidly evolving uh, techno sphere and um, uh, the one world singleton computer that is the internet evolving to web 3 and here I was reading this book getting to about like how Claude Shannon invented the word bit hearing some sounds could be a deer. And I was wondering about the war about the nature of information. How there is the message, how there is the uh, noise, the signal and noise. And it made you think about our own minds and like what moves us and how we move in the world and I was like there's something brilliant here and there's something like that it's like the topic that ultimately is at the bottom of a lot of my contemplations and motivations and inquiries this little stream is a little dry right now chainsaw in the distance but the stream so there's there's some mosquitoes around here so I want to keep moving um and so here I here I am like like at the bottom 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 this is like the question to to contemplate like what makes you do what you do what makes you um so this is like your information, your, your signal. What is your signal? So we are the, the input-output machines and we process what, what data we get from the outside, combine that with our, um, with our DNA our, and our experience data bank. And then we output uh, you know, our actions, our words, our thoughts. Each one of these are outputs. And the question is, like, what, what does it mean when you're being noisy? What does it mean? So this is like, what does it mean when you're listening, tuning into your signal? Is the signal like a message from, from your soul that is like eternal and from like the gods? Like, uh, so like, there's the bicameral mind, of this book about the, whose thesis is that like, the ancient Greeks and those um, 
those ancients that believed in gods, they actually li li literally did uh, experience hearing voices in their heads of the gods, and these are the signals. So, so these could these could be interpreted as like the signals from the world, from um, from your analysis of the forces of, of people of nature. <laughs> and what are these? These forces are embodied as as gods. And so now, in, and. And now in, in these in these days, like yes, we have we have our own voices inside our heads. So this is like we this is like the software is evolving of like the signals that that move humanity. Like so humanity is like a giant uh, uh, one single uh, entity. So it has its own uh, it's like an it's a it's a meta organism, right? And it has its own system of signals. Uh, it's just like how this, the body has a system of signals of of uh, these proteins. And uh, I remember going on a date with this molecular biologist in San Francisco, in, in Alamo Square, and she was she would tell me about like the communication between cells and how it's like chemical. And I was like, this is so cool and interesting. Nerding out about that. I, um, and so these, us, we have our own signals as a collective and like we have a signal of like what we wear, of what we, what we say, what we read, of our attitude, of our posture, of our uh, judgments, our thoughts, evaluations, so on and so forth. These, these, this is like the zeitgeist and the spirit of the times and and it is a it is a process that is a, like a evolving, and so like when we we feel fulfillment when we are in tune uh, with this larger process, and when we feel like we are uh, in the right place where we are fulfilling our internal uh, drives, our internal potential into actuality, into being playing a part in this uh, orchestra of the collective. And there are there are things like there are cultural things, say like like in Russia or in China or in India versus like other countries or like just all of these have there's the nation and then there's the state and there's the culture and there's the tradition and then there's there's uh, there's there's a distance sometimes there's walls between these and um like uh in the uh tales uh the teachings of the of, of the wise men of the far east book volume four uh talking about his experience with the hawaiians how they would sometimes travel great distances just by instinct and be able to come to a group or um or an uh, individual that is in distress, that is in need of help. So these these Hawaiians would have this instinct to be able to uh, to pick up on these signals of uh, of some someone in, in their in their in their group or or in another group uh, being in in need of help, and then they would just go across like hundreds of miles on their boats and just arrive. Okay arrive on some island and be like saving somebody and this is uh kind of like also uh this is this is this is this is like what we're talking about like information and signals picking up signals and coordination and this is where like web3 um DAOs, on chain like organizations are a, like an extension of this where it's um becoming it's becoming the it's becoming uh, merged in with like uh the uh, traditional p paper and and um institutions becoming more uh, digitized and um and now it's 10 minutes so to sum up like um to sum up 
signal versus noise. It goes at each level. Um, ultimately, that's that touches a very important question about like identity and yourself, your mind, about what moves you through each day, your story, about like when you're feeling uh, good versus bad, when you're feeling like you're uh, on top of it or not, when you're feeling like you're fulfilled or not. This is um, this is all part of the same same topic. All right, ten minutes.